the Go High Level CRM. Let's break it down. My name is Pamela Dale, your DHL gal, and I'm going to go into the software and show you around. Stay with me. Don't forget to like and subscribe as well. Always lots more videos coming your way. So Go High Level is a very popular all-in-one marketing platform that includes CRM capabilities. To call it just a CRM, I think it does it a huge disservice. So let's start with opening up the dashboard and let's go take a look around. There's a number of things I wanna show you. First up, let's take a quick look at the dashboard here. So when you log in, you'll get to see immediately some of your numbers based on your opportunities, your pipelines, and your funnels. So very powerful for you to be able to see what is happening in your business at a glance. And if we come into the contact screen, I absolutely love High Level. There are a couple of things that are really incredible. You'll see that we can add contacts very quickly. We can add a pipeline change. We can move them into campaigns and workflows. We can also send SMS, email, tag or remove and delete. We can also send review requests, import and export, and we can also merge from here. I can also set up filters and create a smart list from these filters that I can then use to send different campaigns to. And I can also sort my columns based on any of the fields. And there are a number of fields Plus, I'm able to also use custom fields if I wanted to add in my own. So once I have a quick look here on the three dots, I have quick actions. I can book an appointment, create an opportunity, send a review request, or bulk operations. If I click on the contact, you'll see three panels open up here. The first is the contact screen. I can see contact information, general information, and I can also see any additional information. If I had a form filled out with some custom fields, I can add tags, I can add and remove from campaigns and opportunities, and I can also add in any offers. And as soon as I do that, there's an email that's sent from the system and all of that conversation is here in the middle. I'm able to mark conversations as read. I'm able to also assign to people. This is really powerful over on this side because I can see my first attribution and my last attribution for my traffic source. I'm gonna show you the reporting. And I could also see exactly where people have visited. And I can also see and add tasks, notes, appointments, and I can add new as well. And it's really powerful to see when I go to add an opportunity, I can add in a full opportunity here as well. And I can add and manage additional fields under my custom fields as well. So lots of capability under the contact. I also have the ability to do email verification from this screen as well. Under settings, there's always labs available, meaning this is what's in beta. So I need to be sure that I have turned everything on if I'd like to see all the latest features. And if you don't, you can certainly toggle those off and you'll notice there was a date on them that would give you live in 18 days. So if you didn't toggle it on, it was going to come and it gives you an opportunity to work with the amazing features that are coming. We also can do bulk actions. We can restore tasks. Company is very powerful as well. I can add multiple contacts to a company and I can manage my smart list from here as well. The next thing I'd like to touch on are opportunities slash pipelines. We can create a pipeline that is then an opportunity and I'm able to add cards onto cards, AKA people onto this sales funnel kind of pipeline. And I'm able to move them along. And with this opportunity, I'm able to also have automations that will trigger based on a manual move, or I can automatically also move these cards along using automation. The automations are very powerful in the ability to remove some of the manualness of a business and also to be sure that things are automated to be sure that things are actually getting done. So if I look at a pipeline stage change here as a trigger, I can absolutely choose in the pipeline. And then I can also filter down to who's it assigned to pipeline stage at status. So if I moved it over to is open one or lost or abandoned, then I have a bunch of actions that are available to me 
as well. So sending emails, workflows, removing contacts, granting an offer, if then at an appointment, all sorts of things. It's a very powerful system from that one contact. I can do so much. Another thing I think is really important to touch on is inside of a contact, I have the ability to message in a number of different ways. If I have their email, of course, I can communicate via email. If I have their phone number, I can communicate with them inside of the system using SMS. If I have their phone number as well, I could call them or they could call me. And if I have Facebook and Instagram messages from them, I'm also able to reply inside of the system. I can also automate a lot of those replies as well. I'm able to come into the contact field here and see all those conversations. Now let's jump over to conversations here because this is where it gets really interesting with what I call conversation aggregation. I'm able to see all of the conversations from one client in one place. Remember where you spoke to that last client? No, I don't either. Did they send me a message? Did they send me a Facebook message? Where did they start? Where did I find them? So you're able to see here all of the message channels that we currently have. WhatsApp, by the time you're watching this, is probably live. One of the very few, if not the only, API integration that Meta has allowed. So very powerful for Go High Level to have that as well. By having everything in one system, when a client communicates with you, not only do you see it here, but when they filled out that lead form as well, you're able to see where they visited, but you're also able to see the data from that form. So all of the forms that come into the system, you can create a form that is comparable to type form or Google forms. And all of that information comes into the submissions and I can search by contact and I can also go into the contact, as I mentioned, and take a look at some of the additional information that they have provided me. It's all in one place. Soon we will also have documents on the right hand side over here based on each contact. There will be a documents spot here and all of the documents that that client has signed or you had sent out like a proposal or a contract, et cetera, which are coming at the time of this video as well. By the time you see it, they will be live as well. So that will be really powerful to see all of this in one place. Of course, a big question that comes up is around safety and security. And you'll notice when you go to log in, there is a two-factor code coming. So it's very hard to get hacked as well. And then know that Go High Level is on the Google platform, which is incredibly secure. And the other thing that they do, it's an all-in-one. So is it all going to go down at once? Absolutely not. They've split all of the storage into multiple servers. So if one goes down, the rest of it doesn't. So it's very safe and secure for both you and your clients. I think for your team and for yourself, having everything in one place is going to be paramount to running a really effective business. There's nothing more frustrating than having a team that's disjointed and client information all over the place. And you're not able to effectively work with clients and grow your business in the way that you really need it to grow. Go High Level being an all-in-one with a really strong CRM focus will give you the opportunity to take your business to the next level. Know that Go High Level is continually improving. Next time I do this video, three months from now, there'll be a lot of new features. So if you're thinking about joining Go High Level, I'm your goal and it could very well be time. And I'd love you to join me. There's some links down below. I'll see you on this road.